How's it going everybody? I'm Patrick Static and welcome back to Aporia. I hope you guys are all having a fantastic day. Let me know how you guys' day is going down in the comments. Uh, last time in Aporia we were looking for those damn blasted mural pieces. And uh, I was an idiot and jumped down here. And I was looking at my load games before I jumped into this and it's, it's from a very long time ago. This is from October 11th. This is from September 10th, so a, a pretty hefty jump as we would be, I, I wouldn't honestly remember what we did the last time. So I, I am going to have to suffer the consequences of coming down here. Now there was nothing over here last time I checked as we were ending last episode, so I'm going to have to figure out what the whole purpose of coming down down here was uh, coming down here meant I am severed from the valley I am no longer I'm no longer in the forgotten valley up there so I am oh okay I forgot that doesn't hurt me it just smacks me out of my boat um, so yeah that that part really upsets me that I can't load back in I can but it will take me a very long time and I wouldn't know exactly what I did so let's just is not an accident, just a happy little mistake. You know, gotta have that Bob Ross mentality. A happy little mistake. Happy little accident. Alright. Anywho, we're gonna go back over this way. As I believe there was a dock where we picked up this boat in the first place. And I'm gonna do a little bit more exploring over there. Um, as down the river didn't really have anything. If anything, I will reverse back, and I, I will go back if there's absolutely nothing for me to do. But I would be shocked if there's nothing for me to do down here. Um, I don't think we've gone this way. I know we came down from there, but we don't think I've come from over here yet. It looks a bit kind of creepy. A little bit creepy. It's a big waterfall. Can I go through the waterfall? Is there something beyond the waterfall? No, there is not. Uh. It's just. I can just jump out, though. Okay, buy a boat. Something tells me I'm not supposed to be over here. So, let, let's go ahead and back our boat up. I just keep breaking this game. Alright, let's. Let's get to where we need to get going. Oh, my whole boat just submerged underwater there for a quick minute. Whoops! I feel like I'm completely capable of climbing up those those rocks. I feel capable. I feel very capable. Okay, there wasn't really anything for me that I remember over at the last place that we were at. Which makes me feel like I missed something here. Um... There's this door. This is the door that we came through. But as you guys can see, it is all collapsed. There's no way for me to get back. There is a map. And I'm down here at this fish. Uh, there's cave, cave, bridge. This bridge is very confusing to me. It opens up to the other side though so maybe maybe I do have to go down that way I didn't I didn't see a way to get up there though so ah this is so annoying I will say it this is annoying okay let's go ahead and light our way here come on come on boat we gotta go man we gotta we gotta make this quick I'm being an idiot and no, the, the path is not clear. And I, I guess I kind of like that in a game like this because we get to just fully explore it however we want. The story is never really told to us. We just got to figure it out for ourselves. It's, it's not going to, ow, hold our hands. Which is, which is unique in many games. Not a lot of games do that. Which I can understand why people wouldn't like that as some people... I, I, me, I like being force-fed a story, uh, one that I can get like really into. 
But this game does it in a very unique way through like murals and different drawings and paintings and stuff that really do kind of clench at you. You're like, okay, okay, give me more. But then you have to go through a series of puzzles and kind of just wander aimlessly. And then you find a weird evil spirit in the forest and you kind of want an explanation of, hey, what is that? And the game doesn't really explain it. And that's something I wish it did. So we're back at this bridge. This is kind of where we were last time. Uh, I guess this is exactly where I started, actually. I guess I could try to... Can I, can I jump up here? I, I guess I can. I got a hardcore parkour up. Um, I could grow those dudes. See, I, I was over here, but there was, like, nothing to do. Like, this is all... This is just a tiny little thing. Unless, uh, am I supposed to just swim? If I'm supposed to abandon my boat, then that's that makes a lot of sense. I didn't try that last time. The music is something that I really, really like in this game. I hope there's no big swamp monsters. Because that would kind of suck. A lot. Well, I, yeah, I don't know if I was supposed to break the bridge. Probably. But we're just going to swim. We're going to be a little shark. A little fishy. Just going to keep swimming. Just keep swimming. I can't tell if this is faster than the boat or not. I feel it's about the same speed. It does feel like my mouth is supposed to be... No bubbles spat it up when I said that, dude. What? 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 Why are you here? I see you. Oh, I see you. Mr. Evil Man. What? What? Yeah, hi. I see you. Can you come in the water? I didn't think so. What? Oh, I'm stuck on some trees. This is the perfect place. He can't come in the water. Because he's a big dumb dodo head. Can ya? Nope. Okay, so probably this is why the fish is a, you know, the, the fish symbol is a fish symbol. I had to be the fish. I had to act like the fish. It makes a lot of sense now. Now again, if there was like underwater creatures that like touched my toesies while I was swimming, yeah, I'd be a little scared. I'd be a little freaked out. Whoa! I'd be very freaked out, not gonna lie. Okay. Can I not get on that? Eh. Apparently not. Well, in my mind, we're kind of like over here on the far right. We still have all that to swim. We just swam that little bit. Alright, so we gotta go that way. Oh, I see the light! I can see it! Alright, well, this will be a new area. Um, actually, there may be a way to get back. Uh, the, the tree... There's a tree um, setting, not a setting, but a hallway that I think goes back up to the valley. So we may actually be able to get back up to the valley. We may be able to fix my happy accident. My happy little accident. It is foggy as all hell out here. Very eerie. Very creepy. I need to swim a lot faster. I need to swim a lot faster. What the fuck was that? Oh, I'm freaking the hell out now. No, stop it. Stop it, stop it. Oh, then Marie walks in the room and scares the crap out of me. Why did you do that? It's okay. I'm swimming and there I heard something big and scary just slop behind me. It just like that. But it, it growled too. I'm supposed to be in a boat, but I abandoned my boat. My boat didn't help. So I'm 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 doing a door a Dora Dory. They just keep swimming. Just keep swimming. I hear something behind me. Stop it! What is that? Now there's four little marks at the bottom of my map. No! Get out of the water! What do the marks mean? Oh, 
I'm out of the water. Ah, get out of the water. Okay. We're on dry land. <laughs> yes, dry. <laughs> Shake it all off. We're dry now. There's four different markings now that I have at the bottom of my screen. Uh. This does not look safe. Okay, so the thing I was mentioning was the fish is here, but there's the the tree symbol here, which is takes us back up there. But I don't see a doorway for the tree, actually, now that I mentioned that. Oh, wait, it's freaking right there. Never mind! Uh, I guess we're stuck here forever. We're gonna die. Okay, so there's... There's four altars here, but there's three different totems. There's six, five different totems. But there's... Okay. I need to make my way inland. We're out on the docks right now. We need to go inland. I need to see what this puzzle has for us. Oh. Stay the hell away from me, please. Okay, so the darkness is around these four totems? Puzzles? That light up the main thing. That is my guess. Stop it! I hear it. I hear something jiggling a key behind me. Okay. So these... I'm guessing is that set... Oh, there's blue fire over here, though. The blue fire was part of that little mural. <gasps> oh, Spoopy McSpooper Pants is here. Fudge. Maybe this is his home. Stop it. Stop jiggling the keys. We gotta avoid Spoopy McSpooperton. What is that saving? Oh, the archer lived here and tried to defend with the blue lights. The blue lights is a barrier, maybe, of the darkness? Oh. Okay, I see. Ah. Uh. Maybe I don't see. Maybe it's just really far out there. Uh, there's a lot of health here, too. Okay. Do I want to go over there? My immediate thing says yes. I want to go over there. But I believe I need that first. I have four slots. So this is my thoughts. I need to explain. I saw the blue flame. The blue flame being here needs to be put in those. That repels the darkness. If I stay in the darkness too long, I think I will die. So I need to run around and find the four. Uh, down here, there's five different points I can have fire. Uh, one of them is right there. Uh, but Mr. Spooper McSpooperton is around. And I will need to avoid him as well as he spawned over there now. Oh, wait. So this is... I believe this is a barrier to keep him out. He's right there again. I um, can't run. Can't run. Okay, I've got one fire. <laughs> you can't touch me. Protected. This sucks. So no matter where I go, he's just going to immediately teleport over there. That's not fair. I feel that's a little haxy. Cool. So that... Cool. So that kind of does what I thought it was going to do. I just keep using all of my stuff to grow health, which is fine. I don't mind that. But yeah. Okay, so now let me stand actually in the orbs of safetyness here. Okay. I'm going to check this map out. 
I believe I got this one first. There's one further back from where he spawns, and this one's closer to the docks. No matter where I go, he's gonna spawn. No matter where I go, he's gonna spawn. You can see him spawn in because there's a giant red poof of smoke. There's the next fire. Straight ahead of us. But there he is. I don't think he can get me while I'm in here, though. I don't think he can get me while I'm in here. How well do I think I know that? I don't. Uh, uh. Okay, just keep running. Just keep running. This part's freaking me out. So I think I can hold four at a time. Or I need to do or I need to light four totems at a time. I need to have four totems lit in total. There's five I can go get. So I think the game makes it completely fair in saying, hey, you have more than you need. Which I appreciate. Okay. So this is kind of warding off the darkness. To get to whatever is over there. This is fun. This is actually... I I'm enjoying it, but it's freaking me out. There's two down there I can go get. I haven't been there. I know that there's one over there. So... I don't like this dude. I'm assuming these are orbs of safety in this. I can't say that they are for sure. Okay, so all these points go straight. Oh, he's straight ahead of me. He's in that house. I could see him by the house. Okay, music, could you stop, please? I see him. I'm just gonna nope. I'm gonna nope out of here. I haven't even seen the other side yet. I just need two. I can go right. Okay, so I can go to the right up to the right and there's one here and then there's one at the far end let's try that out let's try that one out because these ones I feel is gonna be really hard to get around him he's gonna pop over here too but there he is okay I'm freaking the hell out this is super spoopy to me I like and hate this. Huh. Hopefully, this means what it does. Okay, so I'm at this one. I can go that way and get the other one. I believe. My issue is. I don't see it. It's right there. Oh, come on. You walk so slow in the mud, which makes sense, but I don't like it. Just, we need to run. We need to run. Safety. Safety darkness. Okay, we're out on the docks again. My heart is racing right now. Take some berries. hoo -ha! Okay, now all we have to do, we have all four. All we have to do is get back. Easier said than done. Yes, I am aware. But, we just have to run down this way. If Mr. Spoopy McSpooperton comes up, we'd just be like, look an idiot, and run. That's all we have to do. Stop jiggling the key lock, please. Ooh. Darkness everywhere, spoopy. Give me that. I don't even think I needed it. I'm just grabbing it. Grabbing and going. Grab and run. Grab and run. <laughs> okay. I will be pissed if I need all five. 
Darkness be expelled from this area. Can I... Can I... Continue? I... Don't know if I can yet. I should wait till darkness falls. I think I'm fine. Okay. Now, I'm gonna run back. My little savey wheel went up. So, progress has been saved. Ooh, get out of the water. Okay, I am gonna... What? What? There's still some light in there. Come on. I guess not enough light for me. See how that is. I shouldn't have grabbed that last, last little bottle. Okay. Well... Let's, uh... What? Wait. What? Oh, okay. I was gonna be like, Excuse me! Okay. Well, we made it into a cave. Okay. Wow, that's really pretty! That looks amazing! A lot better than where I'm at right now. I don't know. That's the trees, though. Is that where we made it? We made it to the tree. I didn't even make it to the temple that's over here. There's a big temple over here I didn't make it to. Instead, we went right through this way and made it to the, the trees. Well, that that closed, closed behind me. All right. It's morning, it seems. Ooh. Ooh, baby. Let's get a story going. I'm ready. So it seems everybody was super happy. Everybody's doing the little dances. Yeah! Oh, and darkness. And everybody... Oh, no! Dude, you gotta run! No! Oh, crap. It's being... They're dragging people down. Oh, crap. Some loved ones got in the boat. They need to go. They need to go. Get in the boat and go. They washed up to a new mountain. Started to become settlers out of a new area. Oh! All the people that left? No! Don't go. Well, why don't we... Why no, no. You gotta stay! Why would you make them stay? So they lived in the trees above the darkness. Hmm. Interesting. Why did he make them stay? Very, very interesting. Why did he make him stay? I always like the guy in red. Huh. There are new trees here. Maybe this is where they settled first. Or maybe this was the town that darkness attacked first. Maybe this is where they lived when the darkness attacked. Maybe. This is the place that maybe ha they maybe had to flee from. Because the darkness was overtaking. What is that? That's new. Take a jug of juice here. Hello. Um. Oh! Nifty. I think I just gotta shine it at the light, right? Nifty. So there's new. Some new puzzles. Some new puzzles we're gonna be having. I'm guessing that's a that's a really pretty pretty mural. Wait, I'm aren't I the woman in green? Am I not? I could be wrong. I thought I was the woman in green. Is this where I'm from? Possible? Ooh. Very big shiny crystal. Oh wait, there's something in there. That's something I need. Okay, we have another mural here. Let's go ahead and read this. Yeah, this is where everybody was happy. I think this is where they lived before the shadows, before the darkness took over. Hello. What's inside here? Woo! Another, some more juice. Thank you for the juice. Like me some orange juice. This is a beautiful place. Or maybe this is where they came after the shadows took over possibly oh, oh there's a lever I need okay so let's go ahead and activate that don't know exactly what we're doing here okay 
Oh, I see. Didn't even see that. As I said, I can only go so far because it's prism. Oh, I see. Oh, I can't make it to that one. Can I make it to that one? Probably not. Whoa! That one's steady in place, so I can't move that one. I can move this one, however. What happens if I... Can I okay, I can't go that far. So I, this is a specific thing I have to do. Okay. So we made it into another gated area. Hello. So, use the light on the vines. Use light on vines. I mean, that's going to make some berries, but... Right? Here? Oh, wait, maybe here. Ha ha! Okay. Okay. So I found out I can use. I think this is me. I think the woman in green is me. I found out that I could use the light to make climb climbable ladders or vines and get to higher places. Which is way cool. And there's the lever I need. Fantabulous. Just jump down. Oop. Ooh, I took a little fall damage. Whoops. Oops. Alright. See, I'm just getting right into this, man. I'm into this completely. Pull the lever, Kronk. Now, there's this area that I haven't gone up to yet. I'm not going to go do that yet. I know the whole point of that puzzle was to get that open to do the pulley system, but I want to know what's up here. Never mind. I guess I won't find that out yet. I guess I'm not meant to find that out. The pulley system is probably my favorite thing in the game so far. Because you just... Yeah. Yeah. It's like an actual pulley system. I friggin' love it. Ah. The graphics in this game are amazing, too. Okay, so still use use my light to make climbable vines. Whoa! This is really pretty. Okay. Okay, okay. Wait, what? Okay, I want to make reflections everywhere. Oh, this is going to be a toughie. Or not. Wait, what? Hold on. It says... Oh, there's different ones that I could hit. Interesting. Where could this one go? Where does that go? Nowhere. So, what's... What's the purpose? What's the purpose of this one? Nothing? Hmm. Okay. How far can I go? That's as far as I can go. Uh, excuse me? Uh, apparently my mouse died. <laughs> okay, I will be right back. Okay, my battery died. Mid puzzle. I apologize. I had to go get a new replacement for it. I was like, uh, it stopped. Okay, so from here, we can do this light. From here, do that light. That light. Does that point to anything? What's my objective? Where am I trying to hit? I don't know. I don't know. So that light doesn't really go anywhere. I can't, I can't move this light at all. So I don't think that's meant to go anywhere. So let's go ahead and point it. How far can, I, how far right can I go? That's as far as I can go. So let's go ahead and move it there. Move that light there. This one's a movable one, so I can move it. Do 
that. So what was the purpose of the other two mirrors then? I don't understand. Okay. Maybe I don't understand. What am I... What's my... Oh, I see. Okay, there's a tiny little thing there. Ah, this right here, I believe, is my objective. So this can go here. This could be shot there. This needs to be pointing right to there. Okay, so this needs to be from there. Got it! This all makes a lot more sense now. I needed to know my end game. I was like, where am I trying to shoot this? This beam of light. How, what? Why is it way over there? There we go. That's... That's what I needed to know, man. Okay. Now it makes a lot more sense to me. It's like, this does, this does make it sense. What am I trying to do? What am I trying to accomplish? I have no clue. What are these rocks? Random rocks. Now, does that mean the pulley system works? It does! I have powered the pulley system. And we're going to the greenhouse! Oh! Okay. I'm just gonna go for a little bit longer as... I'm really enjoying this. Help! Oh. oh, wait, I have to pull the pulley and then go again. Eh. Yeah, I'm on it. Whoa, this thing is jiggling a lot. So now we have that one source. What is up there across the way? There's another pulley, though, so I'll be able to figure out exactly what's over there. Uh, okay. Uh, smacka smacka. Excuse me? Uh, oh. Smacka smacka. Cool. All right, so I'm gonna run. Oh, I will want to be very careful here. Um, excuse me. Okay, I want to figure out what my objective is here. What am I trying to shoot down to? Oh, there's a. If I fell down, like a dork, like I most likely would have, I need to find the gem that I am trying to shoot at. And I'm trying to redirect the beam of light to. Once I figure that out, I'll know the puzzle. I need to, I know my start. I need to know my end. Where is my end? Okay. Go up the stairs correctly this time. Hmm. Very confusing. There's an end. That looks like an end to me. That looks like a very big end. Everybody's still being all happy and stuff. Let's go. Oh, somebody broke into this place. Why would you break into such a peaceful place? You monster. Why? Okay. Well, man, I, I love this place. This this is beautiful. I would love to have my own greenhouse. Man. Okay, so. Wait. Oh, I can move this. Okay, so now we're going horizontal. Gotcha. Okay. So this is... We're breaking a dimension here now. We're going up and downs. We're on a different plane. So my end goal is to get it back up into the greenhouse. That is my goal. So this... Now I know my end. So I know exactly what I have to do. Whoop. I was like, wait, I pointed it at the exact same one. No, I didn't. Wait, can I... Oh! Fancy that! Fancy! That was easy. Sweet. It's kind of easy when you only have like a set number of uh... of ones. Can I go all the way? No, I can't. Balls. Okay. So that goes through that way. I could. No, I can't. I lied. Ooh, that, that's like right on the money. It's like right on the money. Apparently too far away from the money. 
Can I get to that? I can! But that goes nowhere, because this is a stationary one. Okay, so... That's probably not the right one. Now this one I can move. What is that? That's, uh, I think, an anywhere you want to go one. I think there's some that are just thrown in here just to throw you off. Which, that's doing a great job. So wait, oh, so this shoots in three different, t three different beams. Okay. So that light beam that goes out this way, I believe is supposed to hit that, which I can point to the green thing, which powers the pulley system. This goes to this, which should open that door. I'm amazing! Man! I am so good at this! I think the end game is pointing a giant beam of light at that little bulb down there. I think that is my objective here. Yeah, because that one's right there. It's pointing straight down to it. Man. It's games like this where I feel so smart. I feel so smart. Even though I'm not. Oh, I can have it just... Okay. Whoop. Make it! Wow! I didn't take any damage there. I got, I got impatient. So now I gotta run back up. Okay, I made it back up. I failed and fell. Now I just gotta wait. Patience is key. Gotta be patient. I'm in no rush. I'm in no rush. There's a certain evil around these forests, but it's daytime. I don't even know if he comes out during the daytime. But I just gotta be patient. Patience is key. Key, key is patience. Yeah, this is a longer pulley system, I swear. I want to do this puzzle, see what is shining in that little bulb down there. Then we'll call it a day. But I can't move again. No, I'm not missing that. I don't know why I got stuck or what I got stuck on, but... It's like, I'm not missing this. I'm not missing my ride down, man. Look at that. This whole area, I love. I love this. I can see this being like a very modern Kokori forest for Zelda. Because I'm just a Zelda nerd. But, definitely. Let's play some Lost Woods for me, man. I'm upset. Okay, so, right here is my end goal. This should point to it. But there might be new things that happen in here, too. So, let's just have some fun. The puzzles aren't immediately hard, which I can appreciate. Wait, so... Okay, I can't point to that one. There we are. This one points up and down. So if I... Oh, wait. Wait. What? Okay. That's fine. I think that... This one I can point up and down. Is what it was trying to tell me. That's fine. Oh, that... That's one right there. Didn't even see that. Okay. Where would I point this at? What am I stuck on? I'm like stuck on the sunlight. Huh? Also, before we go any further, I'm just gonna do that. In case I fall off again. So immediately confused. Huh? Wait. Wait, wait. This one splits the light into three, three, three zones. Two zones. It splits the light, basically. Wait, what? Ah! Okay. 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 So this light will go through and pierce that beam once this door opens. My puzzle right now is to get this emerald shining. How I do that, that seems to be the question. OK. 
Okay, I need to get on the other friggin' side of this. That's as far left as I can go. Is there another... Hmm. Hmm. Can't move that. Can't move this. Can move that, though. Can I push this up? That just points straight down. Okay. And I, that's as far as I can go. Okay, so this definitely stays right there. Does not move. How far left can I go with this? That's as far left as I can go. So this is... This is all correct. That goes there, that goes there, that goes, this goes, stays here. Uh, I can go there. This might make more sense. So now I move the, oh wait, I can point up now. What does that point to? Nowhere, okay. So interesting, I can point up to these ones. Interesting. That's kind of close to where I need it to hit. Is there a way I can get up there and see if I can move those at all? I don't think there is a way I can move those, but... Maybe there is! Maybe there is. Let's see. There's a reason... Uh, the climbing mechanic, I forgot. A little wonky. I can't move these at all. Okay, so that's a little disappointing, but there are some secrety jugs of juice up here. Can't move that one at all, either. Okay. That's as far as I can go with that. Now this one is the same thing. I should... Yeah, no, that's... Is that as far as I can go? Really? Where does that go off to? Oh! For some reason the beam of light isn't showing, but it's pointing here. Okay, so that that's the puzzle I needed to do. Nifty biscuits. Nifty, 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 nifty. So that's stationary. This can move. And this goes up there. Need to see. Eh, that's gonna hurt in the morning. What is it? Oh. Oh. Ah! Okay. I think this will teleport me back to the valley if I'm. Yes! Yes! Teleported me back here. Hell yes! Shaboopsies! I didn't get the mother freaking fish! Crap! Is that all I'm missing? Is all I'm missing is the friggin' fish piece? I'm- all I'm missing is the friggin' fish piece now. Alright. That's the skull. That's the skull one. But we're back up here. Where's the skull door? Why did I need the skull door? I swear there was a reason I needed it. Anywho. We did it. I'm happy. And I believe I'm actually the... I don't remember. Anywho. We did it. I'm happy. I'm overjoyed. Man. That was great. I do have to go back down there. But not as bad. Anywho, I hope you guys enjoyed this version of Poria. I know there's a couple more mural pieces I need to go find that are hidden around the map. You guys told me last time, so I appreciate that. But if you guys enjoyed the video, smash the like button. Subscribe today if you already haven't. I'll see you beautiful faces all here next time while we go get the fish piece in Aporia. See you guys then!